<laughs> so, uh, what, um, so how, how, how did they get you down here for this? Uh, actually, I don't think, I know it was God, you know, as far as me coming to Tallahassee, because me and my son went out to eat on Sunday, and he was like, Daddy, what you doing for spring break? I was like, what you want to do? He said, I want to go to Tallahassee. So I was like, well, cool, let's go. I said, I'll find out the practice times, and, and I'll see, like, what's going on. And so what happened was we came down here, and Doug called me. He was like, I heard you was coming to Tallahassee. I'm like, how you know I was coming to Tallahassee? He was just like, I heard that you was coming, and, you know, you should be there for the football practice that they have on Friday morning at 9. He was like, trust me, you should be there. I was like, trust you. So I was like, he said, don't you trust me? I'm like, yes, I trust you. And then Coach Tiger called me. He called me. He was like, what you doing? I was like, well, I'm just sitting up here chilling and, you know, I'm enjoying the time with my family. He was like, can you get here tomorrow night? I was like, yeah, I can get here tomorrow night. So when I got here, I, I, I really didn't know, like, what was going on. Really, I thought it was something to do, like, uh, with my son because you know, my son is going through a lot of stuff right now. And so I really didn't know. And then when I got up there and they announced that, man, it was like, First of all, I like thank God. You know, it just just overwhelmed me, man, and perfect time. And what better time than now? On Good Friday, such a great Friday. Yes, <laughs> a great Friday it is. I just, I'm just happy about it, man. Words can't express how I feel right now. You, uh, I mean, everybody dreams of having a jersey retired or a number retired. Yes. Did you think about it at all? Did you ever wonder if they would do it? I mean, it's like when I started playing and I started making plays and I thought about like, oh, maybe one day I can, you know, maybe one day I can get my jersey retired. Maybe one day I can be one of the best at Florida State, not knowing that it'll come, it'll come to time, you know. And as I started playing more, I was hoping that it happened. But, you know, as time went on after I played in the NFL and it didn't happen, I was like, maybe it'll never happen. And then it happened. It's just the timing. The timing is, I mean, God does everything in the right time. Is it a little bit more special because Coach Taggart's here, you know, your guy? Yes. Yeah. It definitely is. It definitely is, man. It's like, it's like, honestly, Coach Taggart, I think you made it happen. But I, I, I thank you for it, and I appreciate it. And it's just an honor, blessing to be in this position, to be up there with those greats, Charlie Ward, Ward Dunn, Terrell Buckley, Deion Sanders, Chris Winkie, Derek Brooks, you know, those great guys, man, Ron Simmons, Ron Seller, you know, it's just, just a great honor to even be mentioned my name with those guys, so I just take it in stride. Hey, it happened. Who, uh, who all have you called today, or how many people Man, have I called had, you? I, you know what, I, honestly, I want to thank everybody who called me and tell them that I said thank you. It's, it's truly a blessing for me, and the best thing about it for me is that people that's calling me, they genuinely care about me, and they genuinely love me, and they call me and tell me congratulations. So that was my highlight of the day. And another highlight, you know, having my son here with me. So when he saw that, he was like, Dad, you are pretty good, huh? <laughs> so, you know, that was a great honor, too. Did you take him in the stadium and show him you work? You better believe it. You better believe it. I told him, uh, like when I walked in the baseball game, they saw the yellow Peter Ward, and I told him, see, you come here, they'll be saying your name. Congrats. Got the same name. Thank you. Man, yes. Awesome. Yes. So I've been I hearing him, that a lot? Right. Yes, I have. And I enjoy every moment of it. Every moment. <laughs> Do you know yet when they'll do it uh, uh, during the season? No, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I know it's going to be a couple of big games coming up. Clemson, Virginia Tech will be a great <laughs> first game. Yeah. Labor, what is that, Labor Day? Yeah. Labor Day weekend. I don't know. It's just, I'm just happy right now. Yeah. They, could, they could do it at scrimmage. <laughs> as long as they do it, you know? What, uh, and then just, again, talking about Coach Taggart, I know you were – Excited when he got the job. Yeah, I was very excited. You know, when I uh, heard about him having the opportunity, it was just overwhelming and happy and joyous time for me because I know him as a kid growing up. You know, we played against each other from youth league to high school. And so when they said that he was getting the job here, I was just excited for him just to see a person from where I'm from let everybody know that, hey, 
as possible. And by him getting his dream job, you know, he coached at what, USL, Oregon, West Kentucky, and now he get an opportunity to coach what he always loved, what he always wanted to be. It's just, it's just a big, it's just a big honor. On and uh, yeah. and you know, I know it's, I know it's gonna be challenging, but that's why we're here. That's why we're here, man. And now the best thing for us to do right now with Coach Taggart is to win. We're gonna make it happen. It's, it's the time. It's time. Time is now. Good Friday. It's a Good Friday. Awesome.